Shark Week here at the zoo, we're definitely focusing on how sharks around the world are in plight. We're unfortunately losing over 100 million sharks annually to overfishing. Here at Point Defiance, we have nine species of shark total. This is Peanut, our zebra shark, and she is a new addition to the Outer Reef exhibit. To me, is one of the really great parts of my job. Being on that one-on-one -on -one level with them is really special. Today, we're gonna to be having our shark feed at the South Pacific Aquarium. We're gonna be feeding five different species of shark. So gotta wash your hands in the pandemic, but also gotta wash your hands all the time <laughs> for, for, the for the sharks. All right, wash your hands for the sharks. All the seafood items that we use here at Point Defiance are sustainably harvested and restaurant quality seafood. And I see that you got this going on here. Yes. And they're also gonna be getting their vitamins and supplements that help keep them healthy and strong. So you take a pill, you push the head back like that, and then push it right in. Looks like you've done it before. This is years of practice. There you go, got it. You think it's good enough? Yes. It all goes into buckets. Each feeding station around the perimeter of the exhibit has a bucket of food. Each station also has a menu that tells us what shark gets what type of food. One aquarist will be tossing handfuls of food into the water as a distractor, and that's for the jacks. They're the fastest in the tank and tend to steal food from sharks. A shark feeding stick is basically a PVC pipe with a tip on the end, made right here at the aquarium, and that allows us to put a fish, put it in the water, and the shark just bites the fish right off the pole. With everyone in place, it's time to start the party. Sharks have a really strong sense of taste. Each of the sharks have a unique menu. We want to ensure that each shark is receiving the proper nutrition it needs. Man, these guys can really eat. Yes, they can. Sharks are basically big fish that are really critical to keeping the entire marine environment in balance. I feel like I learned a lot about sharks on this visit. And now I understand more the need to preserve this magnificent king of the ocean. Thank you, Jose.